So here is an example of how you can introduce two dog reactive dogs to each other. The white dog over there is Sky, and the dog that I'm handling is named Minnow. We started with one dog standing still and one dog moving, and we rewarded both the dogs for looking at each other without barking, looking at us, or looking at each other and then looking away. We then moved to doing some parallel walking, so both the dogs moving in the same direction across the street from each other. And again, we continued to reward them for looking at each other and then looking away, looking at us, or looking at each other without barking. We continued to reward these good choices and these really lovely decisions that they were both making until they seemed pretty neutral. When they seemed pretty neutral, then we moved to doing some parallel walking with less distance in between the dogs. So again, they're moving in the same direction next to each other. Um, and again, we were really looking for neutrality. So if one dog was paying too much attention to the other, we would call their name and encourage them to disengage. Then we did some nose to tail walking, so one dog walking ahead of the other. You can play around with which dog does better following and which dog does better leading. And then we were able to walk the dogs right next to each other. And this exactly is what I'm looking for, neutrality. They're not super interested in each other. That is my goal. I'm not looking for them to be best friends and want to play. I'm looking for them to be neutral about being around another dog. We encouraged them to sniff and explore together, so they got to have fun doing an activity together. And this was at the end of our walk. Um, and as you can see, they're starting to show some mild interest in each other, uh, but they're making really good choices kind of on their own. And then right at the end, a little invitation to play, and that's what we ended on. Super great. This is a really great way to introduce two dogs.